Hey everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Metroid 2 The Return of Samus for the Game Boy The Final Part. Yeah, we're gonna get the game done today, folks. We're gonna finally hunt down that Queen Metroid and end her reign of terror. Now we gotta backtrack to that hallway with the big pit. That's a couple rooms over, so... Try and get there quickly with the space jump. I think I'm gonna go back and work my energy up a little bit, because I wanna prepare. The Queen is gonna be very tough. But there is actually a, a useful trick you can use to make her a little bit easier. And I'll show it off when we get to her. Uh, let's get up here. Kill this guy, there we go. Eh, screw the screw the energy grinding. I'm just gonna get to the next room. Alright, that massive pit should be in here somewhere. You should see like a big gap between two bubble towers. Uh, no, that's not it. Probably gonna be the next one. Yeah, here we go. Gotta go right into this hole. This is gonna take us to the final area in the game. Alright, Queenie, I'm coming for you. Yeah, only one Metroid left on that counter. And that's the Queen herself. Time to put her out of her misery. Then we can get off this godforsaken planet. Jump faster, Samus. Go, go. Do, 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 do. Yeah, this... This is pretty much just one empty passageway here. And don't worry about those, uh... Those pits of, uh, liquid. They don't do anything. They just kind of slow your jump down. Alright, uh, just gotta screw attack or space jump our way to the top here. Yeah, we're just going to be zigzagging back and forth between different rooms. Yeah, and don't fall in this liquid because it's an invisible floor. It'll take you down to the next room, so watch out. You don't want to go through all that again. So just space jump your way past all that liquid. Alright, got another one of these rooms. Jump to the top. And now we run this way. Now we should be closing in on the final area. Right after this room. Keep jumping, Samus. Oh, got another one of these rooms again. Ah, we're in an endless loop. This was the Queen Metroid's plan all along, wasn't it? To confuse Samus. Make her doubt herself. Alright, save on that pedestal there, and now we're gonna space jump our way through this liquid. And we're in the final area in the game. Just like that. Yeah, but there's actually a couple things we need to do first before we actually find the Queen Metroid. Ah, uh, let me get a... didn't get a proper space jump going there. You gotta get a good rhythm going with the A button so you can keep space jumping. If you press it too late, you'll fall, and you won't be able to do another one. I think we want to get up into this room here. This is where we get our missiles restocked and our energy restocked. I think. Either that or it's the ice beam room. Now well, we'll find out which one it is in a moment. Alright, what do we got? Okay, it's the ice beam room. There's a destroyed Chozo statue here. And it holds the ice beam, which we need to go back to. Why? You'll find out soon enough. <laughs> There's a reason for it. Anyways, now we gotta go back to that. Uh, we gotta go find another room which has the the missile recharger and the energy recharge because we need that. Gotta be at our prime for what's up ahead. All right, I think this is the room we want to go in. Uh, okay, not quite yet. There's actually another room we gotta go into first. I think it's way over here though. Yeah, it's gonna be in this sector. Okay, maybe not. Uh, let's fall... Let's go way over to the right. There's actually a third room to the far right, and I think that's what has the missiles and the energy. And I need to refill on that before I can say I'm ready for this final fight. Alright, here we go. Yep, missile recharge station. Excellent. We need that. 
energy recharge. We need that too. All right, folks. Now we're ready. Let's go fight the queen. Let's end this game. Right, let me scooch up my way up here. Oops, that's the way to the ice beam. We gotta go over here. Yeah, here we go. We gotta go up here. Ah, come on, Samus. Use your space jump rhythm now. And now you see the music change. Or hear the music change. Alright, we gotta go through here. And guess what, folks? Well, I should say guess what in a moment. <laughs> Yeah, just jump all the way up here, and through here. Oop. Okay, I gotta go in the ball form. Spider ball. Ah, come on. You know what, just let me go this way. Ugh. What the hell? Some kind of egg there. Now, what the hell? Our Metroid counter just shot up to nine. Uh-oh. Why? Well, the queen has more Metroids in her lair, apparently. And guess what? They're the regular they're the regular kind, the ones you freeze and pump five missiles into and kill. Yeah, we got some regular Metroids to kill now. And these guys are about the same annoyance level as all the other Metroids. They're the same as the regular NES Metroids and the SNES Super Metroid ones. Freeze, five missiles, dead. That simple. And if one of the Metroids happen to latch onto you, use bombs to get away from them. But these Metroids shouldn't pose any problem, though. They're pretty basic. Oh, whoa, man, that one almost had me. Okay. And I think we're done with this room, yep. Whoa, that was close. Too many close calls. Shoot some ice out ahead of me, so just in case another Metroid tries to fly at me. Aha! That's why I do that. All right, here we go. Another Metroid is toast. And still shoot beams. You never know what's up ahead. All right, I got three more. Got two more regular Metroids. All right, make that one now, and then the Queen, and our final regular Metroid of the game. Ah. Oh, crap. Ah. Stop doing that. Confusing my buttons. Ah. Oh, no, you don't. Get off of me. Ah. All right, let's try that again. Ha ah. There we go. Wasn't in a good position for that one. But no matter, we beat it. Alrighty, folks. One Metroid left to go, and you know who that one is. It's going to be the Queen. Final battle, folks. Are you ready? I know I am. Ooh, take a deep breath, and in we go. <laughs> and let me save in case things get crazy. And now let's get those missiles out and get ready. I'm going to try and employ a trick. Ah, crap. I couldn't get it in its mouth. Ah, God. Ah, damn. I was trying to... Open up your mouth. Open up your mouth. All right, here we go. Yeah, I wanted to use a trick and... Ah, oh, man. I don't think I went in its mouth right. You're supposed to get... You're supposed to roll down into its stomach. Ah! Don't go in the spider ball, idiot. Spring ball. Spring ball. All right, here we go. Now we gotta lay some bombs in the queen's bullet. Ha ha ha. That does maximum damage. That's the most effective way to kill the queen without sustaining too much of a beatdown. Ah! I didn't quite get in there right. Don't worry, I'll get in there again. Ah, oh, damn it. Wait, that queen's getting quick now. Ah, oh, damn it. Try to get in there. Come on. Here we go. Swallow me. Yes. Ha ha ha. Blow you up in the stomach again. Die, queen. Oh, okay. Come on. Yeah, bitch. I'm coming for you. Yeah. In your belly again. Die. Boom. Give you some bad heart indigestion. Acid and digestion, whatever. And hooray, we beat the queen. The final boss is dead. And now our Metroid counter is down to zero. Woot! And we're finally done with the game, folks. After we saved the Metroid hatchling. 
Isn't the Metroid hatchling just cute? Oh, believe it or not, in Super Metroid, it's gonna grow into a beast. If you haven't watched my Super Metroid LP already. Yeah, you need the Metroid hatchling to get rid of some of those diamond bar- oh, get rid of all the diamond barriers. You need the Metroid hatchling to get to your ship so you can end the game for real. Oh, let's space jump our way out of here. Come on, Metroid hatchling, make a path for me. Thank you. And more of the diamond barrier goes away. Alright, eat those up. Alright, there we go. Made enough of, made enough room for me to jump through. Come on, Metroid Hatchling, get up there and eat that. A little bit more. There you go. Alright, let's get to the end. I believe my spaceship is gonna be... Or my starship, spaceship, whatever. I think it's going to be beyond this hill here. Yep. We're almost there. Jump, Samus, jump! Reach for the stars! Ah. And let's see where we fall. And we're back at the beginning of the game, folks. Samus' the starship. Let's enter. And thus ends Metroid 2 for the Game Boy. Alrighty, folks. Hope you all enjoyed the Let's Play. I know I have. It was a really, really fun game. And I recommend you guys try out Metroid 2 sometime. Beastly game. And one of my favorites next to Super Metroid. Alrighty, folks. Stay tuned for my next LP. Random. Uh, my next redone LP, actually. Which is going to be Super Bomberman 3. So stay tuned for that one. Hopefully I'll have Seiken Densetsu 3 done soon also. Because after that we'll probably be doing Cartoon Network Racing or another game. I'm not sure which one. We'll see when the time comes. Anyways, folks. Hope you all enjoyed Metroid 2 again, and I'll see you later for my next LP. Peace out.